Okay. Okay. No. No, 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 no. Like, I don't want to horse it, but I want to see it. Another walleye. My goodness, them things are loaded down through here. You want big walleye? I mean, one of the biggest ones I've ever caught. You want big walleye to eat? Yes, thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, thank you, Lord. I have this end of myself. I feel really, really good about it. So we are about to get started. A minute and a half or so away from Lions Inn. Uh, I think there's at least two more guys from the other group down here. Skeet for sure. And I think Mark Rose um, is down south too. I don't know if there's anybody else, but that's what I know of. So six of us down here, but so far nobody else has came. Uh, came down this low to where I'm at. So if I've got this into myself, if I do my job, I think I'll have a chance. So we're about ready for lines in. flop off but they're there i can feel them dude i'm my stuff is bouncing off of them <laughs> i mean they are in there i'm talking about they are in there do it they are in there buddy two pounds nine ounces two nine. <laughs> this could be really really fun <laughs> where'd they go i ain't feeling them like i was what happened to you fish happened to him. Oh, 
<laughs> this little this blade's not a square bill, but it it does pretty good in that stuff. Mm-hmm. It's a Rapala. It's a new one from I guess this year. It's in my it's the next one of the OG baits like the slim. But it's the next uh next one. Yep. Yep, it's called Tiny. You just never know where he's gonna be on that piece of wood. You gotta fish the whole thing, every inch of it. And all of a sudden it was a <laughs> Two pound 14 ounces. You just don't know where he's gonna be. <laughs> It's funny how there, how you could throw it the same thing, just throw and throw and throw and throw and throw and then boom, you'd catch one. Done that some here. Not, not taking as many casts, but take four or five casts at the same piece of cover before you get one to bite it. I got a fish on there. Big old fish. Grabbed it off of that rock. Baby. He did. He absolutely did. Stay on there, buddy. Just come here. He ain't a giant, but he's a very nice scoreable. Yeah. yeah, he picked it off of that rock. I was like, still, still shaking. I'm like, why is it moving? Yeah. <laughs> it's because a fish has got a hold of it. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Yes. Three pounds, five ounces. Three, five. Oh, for the rock, baby. Thank you, Lord. Those fish, when they do that, most of the time they don't get it good because you're just hung in something, you know? Get up in this boat. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> That was a cool bite, wasn't it? Yes, it was. <laughs> Three pounds, five ounces. Three, five. Yes, thank you, Lord. Yes, yes, yes. Look at that algae growing on him. See that? fish sitting right there. I don't know what they are. They're just outside of that clump of stuff. Golly. The bass is what they are. Dude, donkey stomped it. Oh, Jake, see, I'm sitting there. There's a piece of wood there, too. Man, that's fish. I can see them. I 
on my 360. Ounces. Almost a three pounder. That's not a little one. He ain't near as big as he acted like he was. I thought it was gonna be a four pounder for sure. But he's scorable. Like it's horrible. Oh. Stay home there, man. We got it right up under the chin, but we got him. We got him. <clears throat> oh, thank you, Lord. Be still. Three pounds, zero ounces. Three pounder. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Right now, Scott Suggs is in first place at 27 pounds, 13 ounces. Kelly Jordan, 27 pounds, 10 ounces. Jacopo Giudelli, 26 pounds, 1 ounce. Audrey Cole, 24 pounds, 9 ounces. Jacob Wheeler, 23 pounds, 15 ounces. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Time's in. I pulled up here yesterday just to fish that visible one and on my 360 I see this other one down there below it. I bump across it like twice. It's like a 312. Dude, I don't ever miss it on that worm. Down in sixth place. <laughs> So what happens, you go 20 minutes without catching something. Did you see him hit it? Did you see him? <laughs> yeah. Well, he bumped it. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord.
That's the Conway Lock right there now. Three thousand six ounces. Three six chunk. Thank you, Lord. Real short leader on that thing. Yeah. Because you don't want it to come in your guides when you're pitching. Because otherwise it don't ever go where you want it to. Let's use a short piece of 20. Need to get back to catching some. Well, Thrift got to catching some. Go. Two pounds, eight ounces. Two, eight. You are great. <laughs> and I pulled it out there and it's on fung. Oh, dang it. Come right on in here. We just want to check your size. And we're going to let you go. That's all we want to do is check your size. Dude, what is this little spot? Yeah. You know what I mean? And why did I stay away from it for so long? Five ounces. Dude, they bite it like a bluegill. I mean, no different than a bluegill. Or else, like, whatever the rest of the bites I'm getting, they're no different. <laughs> Two pounds, 13 ounces. Thank you, Lord. Stay on there. Please stay on there. Oh my, that's not a bass. What have I got? What is this? It's like a shark. No. If it is, it's like a 42 pounder. I just wanna see what it is. Big catfish. I'm talking about a big catfish. That'd have been great if that had been a bass and it was just a tenth the size of that catfish. <laughs> <laughs> I really like my crankbait back. It would have been just wonderful. People told me that there's some huge cats down here. I saw a big, big one the other day, but just swimming in a really clear creek. Now what am I going to do with you? How big do you think that thing was? 30? Okay, it wasn't too terribly hard. James Elam, 41-3. You have 37-11. Stephen Browning, 35-9. Brandon Coulter down ninth, 
34-5. Tim Horton, 33-8. Wesley Strader, 32-2. Scott Suggs, 29-15. Golly, I'm glad that wasn't a bass. It looked like a big old drum, was really what it looked like. I think. I hope it wasn't a bass. This thing, is that a walleye? Big old walleye. That's what it was, it just followed it up. It's a walleye, a big walleye. You want big walleye? I mean, one of the biggest ones I've ever caught. You want big walleye to eat? If I wasn't in such a hurry, I'd take him home. Dude, that's a big one. Wow. That's crazy, because he followed up the cast before and I got it right here at the boat and twitched it. And he was still there waiting on it. This down here goes everything big. That's the biggest one I've ever seen. Yeah. That's the biggest one I've ever caught. Quite surprised I ain't caught any better fish today. The first day I had a 5.4 and a 413. The second day I had three or four four pounders. 310, 312. Golly, I just A little small mouth. Dang, I don't think he'd have scored. Thought he was like a little bitty. I don't think he'd have scored. <clears throat> that one's not small. Stay on. Dang drag slipped when I caught him up in the air. I could see I had him under the chin, but I was like, I think I've got him pretty good in the meat. It's not a bad place to hook him if you get him in the meat right there. Oh, thank you, Lord. Pounds, six ounces. Yes. No, the stinking walleye. I saw him eat it. I mean, yeah, I had that much line out when he ate it. Apparently, they like to follow it to the boat. Hold on. Hold on. Stay on there, fish. Please stay on that hook. Please, Lord Jesus, let him stay on. I need this one. Please come here. Yes, thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, thank you, Lord. Oh. 
Yeah. Look at that one on tiny. Right there, get you some. Four pounds, 14 ounces. Mm-hmm. Almost a stinking five pounder, yes! Row a rock. So I was, I was way below the cut. Holy. Just hold that thought a minute. Stay on there, baby. Holy, stay on there. Oh my goodness. I shouldn't have done that. I just flopped. <laughs> Get him off there real fast. <laughs> oh, thank you, Lord. I'm so glad he stayed on there. Did that bait hit the water? I made like three cranks and boom. I can probably quit, can't I? I'm probably good then, ain't I? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> Don't ask me that. <laughs> I mean, three pounds in an hour? Shoot, that's plenty. This one will add to our total. Two pounds, four ounces. Thank you, Mr. Two and a quarter pounder. Biggin, biggin. Stay on there. Okay. No, 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 no. Come here. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, Lord, have mercy. That's something to take years off your life right there now. Three pounds, 15 ounces. How much? Three pounds, 15 ounces. Oh, oh yes. Oh, yes. I had her pinned against the boat, dude, and she had one hook in her. Flopped out of my hand. Don't jump, don't jump. Got him. Thanks, sir. Yep. Appreciate it. Yeah. This got me a three. This got me a three fifteen before you got here. How you doing? Good to see you, buddy. What's going on? You just missed an absolute disaster of a fish catch. I landed him, but I 
I got him upside the boat, pinned him against the boat. He had one hook in him and he shot out of my hands. But somehow he stayed on and I got him back up. We've caught enough for, to have a fish fry to feed the whole crew as well. bass. No, it's a bass. Stay on there, baby. That fish wasn't anywhere I was expecting to do anything. I was just going. Stay on there. No, it's a walleye. That's why he wasn't where he was supposed to be. It's a big old walleye. Well, I have caught some dinner today. I mean, this is a baby compared to the one I caught earlier. Man, this hurts to throw these things back. They are so tasty. That little rapple of OG Tiny is a multi-species bait. He's caught a couple big ones of lamb today and some big old bass too. I figured they were. I figured they were watching that intently to see what it was. Be a bass. Please be a bass. I don't know what it is yet. I've not seen it. I'm afraid it's another walleye. Like I don't want to horse it, but I want to see it. Another walleye. My goodness, them things are loaded down through here. Slabs of meat, son. Like we made a championship round, baby. It was a hard, hard fault day. I mean, all day long, I was in and out of the cut. Um, that makes it extremely, extremely stressful. But man, it's so, so good to end up on the right side of that right here at the end. Um, man, that, that's a, it's a dang good feeling. I was, I was starting to fall behind a little bit and uh, and made a little move down here earlier and pulled up on, on a little rock pile and threw that little dude right there out. That's a that's a rapple of tiny. Just came out, just released uh, around the ICAST this year and caught a 414. And then I, man, it kind of got the ball rolling and got to catching, catching some more good fish and caught a 315, I think it was, a little bit later. So those two fish were, were huge, huge for my day. And they both came on that little bitty crankbait. That doesn't look like much. You wouldn't think of throwing a flat-sided crankbait on Lake Champlain in August, but dude, it's been working. That and Slim has been a big part of my deal. Um, Texas Rig has been working too with a Bass Pro Worm and, a, and actually caught some on a drop shot today, but uh, man, it's a fun deal. Down here, down south, not a lot of fishing pressure. It's just the way I like it. Sometimes not a lot of cell service, so I apologize for that, but, uh, but it's dirty water, shallow fishing, and it is a fun way to catch them. So very excited about fishing this championship round. Very, very excited about that. 20 bass. Congrats. Thank you, sir. Very good. Appreciate it. <laughs> Appreciate it. We fought and we fought and we fought and we made the championship round. It's a good thing too, because Wheeler and Ayler both made it. So uh, nobody's gonna gain a lot. Nobody's gonna lose, lose a lot on this one, but, uh, but definitely important to have made that championship round. Fought hard, man, that was a, uh, has a tough battle. I have no idea what we have left for tomorrow down here, but this is what I've got. And uh, this is my place where I'll be. I'll be locked up fishing. Hopefully we get some good conditions for down here and, and make these fish bite. I know they're here. Uh, it was a lot harder today than it was the other day. So they're here, they're around. We just gotta figure them out and do some work tomorrow. So made the championship round, baby. Coming up next.